Hi, I'm Julie with Limitless Van, and I'm here today with a Mercedes 170 four-wheel drive sprinter, and yes, it is our first sprinter. We typically build on transits. We have several more Mercedes coming down the line, and we're really excited to show you this conversion. So today, I'll go through different features that we love in this van, components we use, and I'll start with the exterior. All right, let's start by talking about the suspension. We consider an upgraded suspension system essential. It's the foundation of your conversion, and it's gonna protect the life of your conversion. So this van features a Van Compass 4.3 Topo kit, along with Falcon front and rear adjustable shocks. We also have black Rhino Havasu wheels. Up top, we have the Flatline Vanco low profile roof rack with a Fiamma awning and Baja Designs load lights. In the front of the vehicle, we have ruby lights mounted to the bumper. These are dimmable lights. So they can work for fog lights or high powered lights on a dark road at night. All right, let's move to the rear of the vehicle. All right, in the rear, we have a ladder that we built and fabricated in-house and attached to it are two low, low bike racks. This is a really simple and easy, low profile solution for mounting bikes. Let's move into the garage. Here we have two wheel well cabinets. They house really important systems in the van. This one has a 20 gallon fresh water tank with an exterior shower. The shower is heated through the Rixons hydronic system. The reason we love Rixons is it's one system for hot air and hot water. This cabinet houses our electrical system. This van is built on a 24 volt Victron battery system. So it has two 200 amp hour batteries, which is equivalent to 800 amp hours in a 12 volt system. Also up top, we have two 100 watt Zamp Obsidian solar panels. On this cabinet here, we have a ski and snowboard rack. And then we also have L-Track for mounting dirt bikes, mountain bikes, all your sporting equipment. And last but not least, we have the air compressor port. This is a great tool for inflating your toys, paddle boards, kayaks, and of course, for cleaning off your gear. All right, let's move to the inside of the vehicle. All of our vehicles come with a custom metal trim package. This one right here, you'll see it's backlit by the OEM dome lighting. So it's easy to get in and out of the vehicle in the dark. It'll automatically light up when you open your van. We also have another air compressor port right down there. And then also connected to the OEM dome lights is this headliner shelf. It will also light up right under here whenever you open or close your door. All right, moving on to the cabinetry. We have a two person bench seat that has storage underneath. Mounted to the side is a lagoon table, which creates a nice space to work or to eat. And then of course the kitchen galley. So this is a maple butcher block countertop and it has a flip up counter space, which is really nice. Gives you a space to cook in your vehicle with the single induction burner and the Rivati sink and then a Dometic refrigerator. Now we built all of our cabinetry in house. So this is metal framed cabinetry and it's really important that we mount all of our cabinetry to metal infrastructure. So it's really secure and it makes it a lot safer having all of these heavy components in your vehicle. This van was built for a four season recreator. So it is built as a toy hauler. That's why we use the Adventure Wagon Moab bed. It's an adjustable height bed. So you can store your dirt bikes underneath, hydrofoil. You can keep them safely in your vehicle at night while you sleep up above them. So we really love this bed. We also installed coat hooks over here. It's just such a super simple feature, but it's a great place to hang wetsuits, um, ropes, jackets, you name it. And then of course, we have the control panel. This has the Garmin magnetic overlander control. And one thing that we love about this Garmin control system is that it's really easy to use. It's user-friendly. Even if you're not a super techie person, you can figure it out. All right, so this van features a JL audio system. It's controlled by the OEM head unit, which means when you're driving down the road, you're listening to really high quality sound. And then with a the push of a button, it can be controlled on your phone back here in the rear with this Bluetooth system. It's powered by the house battery package, which means you're not draining your car battery while listening to music. All right, so that's it. This is a custom build for a four season recreator. If you've got a custom build in mind, go ahead and reach out to us, limitlessvan.com or at Instagram at limitless underscore van.